Hello and welcome back to JP Gaming. Yeah, let's see if we can with a probe instead. So this had 7,600. I guess gonna need about nine or eight thousand. I eight or nine thousand. I should have said a couple of those at the same time. Yes, yes, yes. Okay. This is a very weird rocket. But this is generally how it goes for me <laughs> when building in RSS, aka real solar system, aka hardest thing I've ever done in Kerbal Space Program. I just remembered I don't have any struts. This is gonna bend like hell. Yeah, that's that feels safe. No, we're in a space high above. Come on. No. Doesn't work. Still says in space near. And now we're gonna start falling down. Okay, it didn't work. And damn, I really need to get myself some struts. Because this is not safe. <laughs> this is not safe at all. Come on, give us that science. Near Earth, still says we're near Earth, although we are 2,000 kilometers up, and that is what the Google page said. I think I'm gonna give up on trying to get in space high above right now um, and try maybe and just focus on getting some other stuff. Although I just realized that this might not have worked after all. So we decouple this. This thing is technically below the heat shield. So that might blow up once we re-enter. I guess we'll just have to try re-entering and see if it does or not. If we are, then we are probably gonna see them soon. No, it's actually not. Okay. No, okay, it did explode. I think it was that at least. No, it was a nose cone. Hmm. So I, I guess the game didn't consider this the uh, experiments, experiment storage unit to be below the heat shield. Which, I mean, I'm not complaining. You mean you have to be in Kerbin orbit for it to count as, your, as being... F well, it's not Kerbin orbit. Oh, and I forgot to open the parachute and now we exploded. Because I was reading the screen. I was reading other screen. Perfect. All I know is I need to go to new biomes to get more science. Let's try and send something to the poles. Oh uh, yeah, I know about the uh, different biomes around the um, launch complex. And I'm going to go around and take science from that. But I need to get a little bit more science right now. Just so I can unlock the wheels and build a rover and then my plan is to just take that rover and drive around and get science from everywhere. So I have already planned for that actually. <laughs> and yes, I agree, it's a little bit cheating. But then again, when you're stuck, what are you gonna do? And maybe we need a big rocket overall because it doesn't seem like we're gonna get there. Okay, I know we're not gonna be able to get like a hold up here with this so let's I think that we should just land over here on land and see if it's a new biome and if we can get any science from it oh no everything else explodes now okay that was not as safe as I thought it was did all of my experiments explode yeah okay they did sucks that all of our experiments got destroyed. But at least we got some science. And this was the first um, the first mission in quite a while where we actually got some science. Maybe I can make something that can fly around the case. See, anyways. Even though I don't have any wheels. I mean, it would be possible. This... I, it could work. Because I just need to, like, float around some different places. Maybe I should add some landing gear on this just to be safe you know 
Um, I guess we could launch it on the launch pad. Let's put a parachute on. Again, just, just to be safe. We're gonna need a scientist on. This is gonna be so weird. This might, this just might work. So we're gonna try and just ho like hover, fly this thing around. Okay, the readouts were not correct. Okay, we're, we're gonna go back, uh, we're, we're gonna recover this now and see how much we got. So we can still get a little more science from flying around the KSC. And of course, whenever we get a new experiment, we can do that whole thing again uh, with the new experiment. Damn, got 106.969, nice uh, science from, from that. That is... A little bit like cheating <laughs> but yeah we can go back there with some of the experiments uh, of course we you can also do some of the experiments twice if you didn't know uh, you can do that okay let's see what should we get not important right now would be real nice to have these two but not a priority right now sadly enough we need this way more so we can have struts struts is gonna make everything so much easier small reaction wheel really want to have that as well and this one so we can have two kerbals on did get this one with the fuel lines and the bigger tanks but we haven't been able to use those tanks because we don't have the engine so i think this is the best thing we can get right now yes we're gonna get the engines anyhow thank you so much for watching and have a good one uh, bye bye